be patient with your success. All right, a lot of you dudes, you're very caught up in instant gratification or wanting the result right now. It's not even that you want the result right now, you just don't have the right mindset when it comes to long-term consistency and dedication and what it takes to really get good with something. Whether it's women, building your confidence socially, building a business, building a brand, a relationship even, relationship even. I made this mistake too. Start dating a girl, shit's not going your way. And I've been brainwashed by fucking red pill earlier on in my journey that, oh, well, if she's not doing this or that, tell, tell that bitch, go take a hike. Like, dude, you really think you're just gonna meet a girl and she's just gonna be your absolute everything, know exactly how to treat you and you're just in your dream relationship? It doesn't fucking work that way, dude. Nothing works that way. The only thing that claims to work that way is the bullshit that these people online try to sell you. I've spent over 200K on mentors, business mentors, personal development mentors. I've noticed with a, a handful of these dudes, everybody's making outrageous claims. It's a combination of that, advertising, social media. Everybody's trying to sell you the quick result, the bullshit fantasy. Right? Even if you like start an account, TikTok will, TikTok will boost your first couple posts so you start to go viral, so you get a little bit of dopamine spike, so you get excited about blowing up and becoming famous. Dude, views don't mean shit. Virality doesn't mean shit. None of that equates to long-term success. Studying a pickup line, that doesn't mean shit. Get rich quick doesn't mean shit. You're gonna be in it for the wrong reasons. I've worked with a lot of dudes who made a lot of money, they're not any more happy. Because once you have that thing, whatever the thing that's missing in your life, it's women, it's money, it's your physique, whatever it is, the moment you get the thing, you realize it's not even about the thing. You need to get those things. You need to get the physique you want. You need to get the women you want. You should be making fucking money, right? The only guaranteed ways to get those things to build a true business or brand is consistency, which takes patience. So you gotta be patient with your success. And when I say that, I know there's some dude on here that's like, awesome. Well, that means I don't need to take action today because I can just be patient. I'll, I'll, I'll wait on that. I was gonna join the program, Kyle, but I need to think about it. You know, I gotta be patient, waiting for my time. No, dumbass. That's not what I'm talking about here. Fucking plants in my face. That's <laughs> not what I'm talking about here. I'm talking about the consistency. You need to be patient with the consistency because you're not gonna see the result right away. You're not just gonna get into social skills and approaching and then you're bagging your 10. And even if you did, you're gonna lose her. You're gonna be so excited, so in your head. There's something that happens when you get the result. Your, your brain starts freaking the fuck out. Even when my channel started going viral, which didn't happen overnight, by the way, that took me a year straight of posting two to three times a week. And before that, I was a student of the game for six years, studying all the mentors, studying all the paid programs, analyzing the market, the niche. This shit didn't happen overnight. Consistency, there was patience. There was patience when it came to my social skills and dating life. And even when I started approaching, dude, that shit took years for me. It doesn't need to take that long, but it still takes a while. Dudes come into my program with such a fucking unrealistic expectation. Such an unrealistic expectation, guys. It's consistency. It's the small actions that go on on a daily basis. You're not going to go out one night a week and live your dream dating life, dude. Now, look, you could have one to two days out of the week where you push it a little bit harder, where maybe you do go out with some friends and you get more interaction in. But it's the consistency on a daily basis that's going to really build the momentum and internalize the concepts. If you played piano once a week for an hour, you're not going to be a fucking, you're not going to get that good at piano, dude. Six days went by without you even touching the keyboard. You need to play the keyboard every fucking day, even if it's for a little bit. Well, I don't have time, Kyle. Yeah, you fucking do. I promise you, you do. You just don't see it because you're not trying to do it every day. Like I just picked up a new routine for my content. I'm trying to do even more content. Before I wasn't, I was doing enough. I was good was good 
It's like some of you guys with your dating life and your fucking social skills and your physique and your life as a whole. How's everything, dude? Yeah, it's good. No, it's not, dude. It's not, because I'm looking at you and I see my old self there. Maybe even lower than my old self, so it's not good. And like I was saying with the content, I just recently picked up a new content strategy. The strategy is really, I'm just gonna put out more content more consistently. So lucky for you guys, I'm gonna really be blasting this shit because you need to hear this shit, dude. You need to hear this, you need to be around this consistently. Links in the descriptions for the coaching programs, guys. You need direct guidance, accountability, and structure with your mindset, your social skills, your life as a whole, your discipline, your consistency. Click that fucking link down, down below. And don't tell me you don't have time. Don't tell me you need to think about it, dude. Stop fucking around. My new content strategy, I was thinking about it, not for a long time. I didn't sit there and fucking dwell on it, but I was thinking, damn, this is going to be a lot. I don't know how I'm going to be able to do all of this. But you know what I did? I was like, let's just start fucking doing it. Let's just actually go through it. Shut the fuck up, brain. But what if this happens? Who gives a fuck? Let's go through it. And that's what I started doing. I started doing it. I started posting this shit every day, multiple times a day on Instagram too. Follow me on IG. This daily, hourly content going up like this shit. Good shit you need to embed deep into your brain. But what I noticed was after just like a couple days of doing it, literally two days, it started two days ago. I'm, four, I'm not even 48 hours in. What I noticed was I'm able to get the content out quicker and more efficiently by going through the actions. I'm learning. It actually doesn't take as much time as I thought. I'm getting better at putting out the content. I saw from the first two days the mistakes I made. I'm able to think of the concept and execute it quicker. And that makes me feel even more confident about going through that process. So that habit and that action and the self-talk as I was going through it made me level up in two days. In fucking two days, I feel stronger, more confident, working harder, more efficient, and more dialed in when it comes to putting out the content. I didn't come up with a script for this video, guys. This is off the top. But it's very true and it's very relevant to my life and I'm seeing a massive transformation literally right now. You're witnessing it right now as I'm making this video, the brain is rewiring. That's the fucking cool part of this shit. It's actually kind of trippy as I'm saying it out loud, but it's happening right fucking now. The only way that that happens though is that you tell the, the doubt, the thought, the bullshit about whatever the thing is, whether it's approaching or content or branding or moving. I just moved to Miami. You see this fucking tropical tree. I just moved out here. The moment you just tell the brain, shut up, let's just do this and then see what happens. You'll figure it out on the way, dude. But you got to stay patient with that. I was prepared. Not that my content's suddenly amazing because I did it for a day or two. It's getting better. I'm noticing it getting better. But my mindset and back to the point of this video is that the patience is what's going to get you the success. So even though I'm seeing slight progress, it's not real progress. Nobody would notice the progress because most of you guys have a negative mindset around it. You go out for a day or two or you put out a piece of content. You think it's a bad thing that somebody unfollowed you or left a negative comment or a girl rejected you. I, I wouldn't think that if I sent you out there and you got rejected, I'd be like, fuck yeah, dude. You know why? Because look at where you were at last week. Now you're actually in a fucking interaction and you're doing the hardest part, which is just pulling the trigger, telling your brain, shut the fuck up. I'm going to do this. That's the hardest part. It's the consistency with that part. And that's why the patience is the most important part of it. It's the consistency. It's the patience. It's the self-talk. It's the habits on a daily basis that's moving you towards those goals. All right. If you want to work with me personally to really level up, it's one thing to push yourself through it. Most of you guys can't do that. Or if you do it, it's slow as fuck. If you really want to go harder with this, if you want somebody like me telling you exactly what you need to do to fast track that shit, I've been through it all. I'm on 10x what I was on a couple years back right now, guys. Click the link in the description. I'll talk to you soon. I'll be reaching out to discuss next steps. Let's fucking get it. What's up, my man? What's good? Have a good day. You want me on the camera? It's blurred out. They don't even see you. Peace out.